A lot of dog trainers will use this as an excuse. They say a dog can only learn for an hour before their brain starts to melt. That is false. I have an organic approach to my training, which I get dogs off leash in two sessions. It's extremely important to give dogs a break. I bop around, I grab a coffee, give them AC, take their mind off it. I'm addicted to progression, but every time I get out of the car to a new park, they're sharper, sharper, and sharper. A common mistake a lot of dog tracker a common mistake a lot of dog tracker an, an inexperienced dog trainer will tell you they a dog can only listen for an hour before their brain starts melting. Now that may be true, but it's also false. I get most of my dogs off leash and under control in two sessions by bopping around parks in a very organic style fashion. We go swimming, I give them AC breaks, I'm addicted to progression. Now don't get me wrong, I've got to give them breaks, but if I give this dog a 30 minute break as I give him some AC, I get coffee, once he gets out of the car, he's going to listen much better. It's muscle memory. These dogs don't forget what they were working on. I've only been working with this dog for about an hour. We drove to the next park. She's had a 15 minute break. Now let's take a look and see how sharp she is. I don't know if any of these are good, but... <laughs> 